It's week six of the 2010 NFL season, and the first thing I want to say is Brett Favre. Good job, man. She is smoking hot, that Jets reporter lady. And sorry about your nuts. And who has seen that video? Brett Favre getting hit in the nuts by a football? It is totally the Simpsons Matt getting hit in the groin by football. Or you guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, it's an awesome video. It's freaking hilarious. You put Brett Favre getting hit by a football in the groin and the Simpsons man getting hit by a football in the groin. It's awesome. Anyway, uh, week six, I am four and nine. I know, it's a losing record, but the season's not over yet, so stick around. Um, let's go with game number one. We got the 2-2 two two Miami Dolphins at Lambeau Field to face the 3-8-2 Green Bay Packers. Let's look at the Miami Dolphins first. Okay, let's look at the uh, Green Bay Packers now. Aaron Rodgers is probably going to play. Probably, probably not. Michael, Jermichael Finley is out, and Clay Matthews is out. Their key players in the offense and in the defense are out. So the Dolphins might have a chance to win this game in Lambeau Field. Crazy, right? But if Evan Rodgers is playing, I don't see the Dolphins winning. But since we don't know yet, it's probably a game time decision. Right now, I'm going to go with the Dolphins. And I want to lock in my vote. Dolphins to beat the Packers in Lambeau Field. Game number two. We got the Baltimore Ravens in New England to face the Patriots, the Randy Mossless Patriots. This is the first game without. This is their first game without Randy Moss. And I like these two teams. I do. I like Tom Brady and his hot wife. I like the Ravens defense. In but reality, it's a good defense versus offense match. Um, which all games are like that, right? But you got a good offense with the Patriots and a great defense with the Ravens. I, I like both teams, but I'm going to have to go with the Ravens on this one. They do say defense wins games, so Ravens is one of the best out there. So I'm going to go with the Ravens on this one. And uh, Game number three. Now, I know what you're going to say. Oh, well, that's an easy one. It is going to be the Cleveland Browns versus the Pittsburgh Steelers. They're playing in... Heinz Field, yes, the ketchup field in Pittsburgh. Now, let's look at the Cleveland Browns. Seneca Wallace, done. Jake Lalome, done. Both nursing ankle injuries. Who's coming in for them? Ex Texas Longhorn, Colt McCoy. Yes, Colt McCoy. You guys remember him from uh, last year's national championship game? NCAA college football got hurt like in the first play well he's gonna be starting he's gonna be making his NFL debut against the Steelers whose defense has been kicking ass all season long and guess who's back for the Steelers side Big Ben Roethlisberger he's coming back and he's coming back to play football well anyway I have the Steelers winning this one and if they don't, Jesus, God help us. Well, anyway, those are my top three picks for this week six of the 2010 NFL season. And I just got one thing to ask you guys. What do you think of Josh Lux and letting the dogs out about paying college players? As always, thanks for watching.